Dead series, dudes. Uh, you're probably wondering why I'm in the uh, end. Well, it's space. It, it's a re uh, this is a reboot, and uh, I hope you guys are excited because the reboot is always better than the original. Okay, just uh, dudes, uh, get ready for an awesome adventure. All right, guys. Well, I'm sure you're interested in knowing what's going on. Well. Uh, the truth of the matter is, we're back with Zero Gravity, guys! Zero Gravity Season 2! It's been years! I think it's been over a year, maybe two. I have no idea. But I decided let's bring it back and see what we're able to do since I found that really cool mod that'll let us actually build a moving spaceship! It's gonna be amazing! I, I hope you guys are excited and I hope you'll leave me a like! Leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe if you're new! Number one thing you can do though is follow me on Instagram. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks a lot, fellas. Thanks a lot. Dudes, uh, okay, I got so much stuff to show you. Now, guys, I have three, uh, three tools. Unfortunately, I was forced to take these three tools, so, um, but I've thrown away everything else, all right? I've got three tools, but I threw away everything else, and this series is gonna be legit, guys. So what we're gonna do is I've actually gotta get some wood, guys, and then we're gonna go to space, and I'm gonna show you the spaceship. Now, guys, like I said, I've gotten rid of everything. I pretty much have gotten rid of everything that that I once had uh, while setting up this world, all right? So now we are playing from scratch and it's gonna be legit, okay? So I've already set up these marks, okay? So I got some wood. Uh, I'm trying to think of things I need to bring to my spaceship. Now guys, if I was in a, since I have a spaceship, what kind of things does a spaceship need, all right? I've got wood. Um, I kinda need food of some sort. So I'm, I'm gonna have to like look around and maybe find some food. I'm not really sure where I'm gonna get the food from, but I need to find it. Okay, so guys, after I finished killing these pigs, I realized that I probably should have given myself a sword, but I don't want to give myself too big of an advantage, so there's that. Whatever. Alright, so now I was thinking about it, and I was like, the only thing left that we don't have currently is cobblestone. So I'm going to dig a hole, we're going to grab some cobblestone, and then we're going to make our way to our brand new spaceship. Now guys, the spaceship is going to evolve as the series goes on, so we're going to continue to make our spaceship bigger, it's going to be great. This area here, of course, is not a natural spawn, all right? This is not a natural spawn. I actually found this before the series started. This is now basically our teleport area. I haven't used any modded blocks to make it look all, like, spacey and stuff, but eventually we will. For now, though, it's just this. So check this out, dudes. Check this out. So we're in the end. The dragon's already dead. I've already killed him. Uh, our spaceship is out here. Now, guys, this is not us. Oh, God. Oh, God. Wrong button. Wrong button. Wrong button. Wrong button. Okay, guys, well, this is it. I seem to have lost all of my resources. We're not going to talk about that. But this is a space station, guys. This is, uh, okay, okay. There's no glass, but eventually I'll have glass. But I needed an area to actually build our spaceship. <gasps> guys, that's our spaceship over there. It's amazing, dudes. I'm not even making it up. That is our spaceship. We're going to test it. I have not tested it. I don't even know if it works, all right? But, uh, yeah, this right here, this, of course, is our teleporter. Uh, we'll be able to teleport to the overworld from it, but right now, this is our space station. It's gonna look good when we get some glass up here. Uh, it's gonna look real good, all right? But anyway, this is our spaceship. I already have a door on board. We open door, enter the spaceship. All right, now I have to break this. Close the door, closing the hatch, reach in here, take out the pilot seat. Uh, we won't be able to place this until we are uh, mobile, so in three, two, one. And there we go, we are mobile now, we are mobile. Now, unfortunately, it's going to take a little bit of practice. we got to learn how to drive this thing. It ain't the greatest driving thing. Um... There we go. Check it out, dudes! Check it out! Okay, so my hatch apparently has disappeared. We'll worry about that later. But check this thing out, dudes! We have a spaceship! Oh my god, it's so fast. It's so freaking fast! Like I said, though, we'll be able to build a giant spaceship. Right now, we just kind of have the basics right here, but eventually we will have a massive spaceship that we actually can fly around. It'll be legit. All right, now, here's the problem. Landing this thing is not easy. Uh, I shouldn't say landing, but uh, attempting to park is not the easiest thing that we've ever done. I'll say that. That's our spaceship, guys. It's uh, it's actually pretty good. Now, the cool thing is we're going to be able to work on the spaceship uh, without actually having to, uh, without without having to, like, uh, what it was to work, park it. 
So we'll be like right now it's parked, but it's not completely parked. But I can already start adding things to it that'll make it better, dude. I think the only way we're gonna be able to do this is use pistons for the doors, because I don't think the doors are gonna work correctly. What we're gonna do, dudes, is we're gonna need a lot of metal, but we're gonna like actually make this look like a spaceship. Apparently the glass is like messed up or something on the front of it, dude. This is crazy. But uh yep, yeah, welcome to the spaceship. I'm gonna break this and we're gonna move this into there. Alright, so this is our base uh when we're not at base, guys. So this right here will take us to the overworld where we can gather supplies to start working. I eventually want to encase all of this in glass. Once it's encased in glass, it'll actually look like a little space station and everything, but I don't want to build a space station. We're going to upgrade this spaceship until we're riding around in a super fortress. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. You don't have a pilot's license. It doesn't matter. I can pilot a spaceship. Just call me uh, Buzz Lightyear. Oh, more like Buzz Bluebeard. <laughs> I gotta point something out, because I keep forgetting. Guys, this is a creative physics infuser. I spawned in a creative physics infuser because it works better and we will be able to build better structures. So I wanted you guys to know that right off. The actual infuser right here and the hover mechanic right here are both spawned in. The reason we do that is so that we can make bigger structures, okay? Cool, I just want you guys to know what was up. I didn't want you guys to be like, oh shit, uh... So what we're gonna do now is we gotta go back to the overworld and get supplies because apparently I died. I would love to find a village, but I have not located a village. And this needs to look more like a teleporter and less like I'm going to like the Wizard of Oz. Oh no, Toto! So I've been running around here, guys, and I just figured out what we need. We need like a little space landing thing. Uh, what do you call it? A space, uh... What do, what do you call it? We need the space thing that will, uh, like a space, uh, a shuttle. Like, we can fly around in the overworld, dude. Dude, ever since I found this mod, this mod is amazing. I just want to play with it all the time. I'm not even lying. We got to play with this mod more. Thank you, baby Jesus. There's cot, dude, we got coal. It's finally. All right, so what we need to get our hands on right now, I'm not even kidding. What we need to get our hands on is, uh, we need to make another freaking physics infuser and build like a little what do you call it what do you call those things ah we need to get one of those dudes i can't think right we need to make a shuttle dude i don't know what's wrong with me today this is crazy we gotta make a shuttle so i've got our uh i've got our new i don't know if you call this a spaceship or a shuttle but i've got our new shuttle up this is what we're gonna use for the overworld guys we're gonna use this thing to uh i don't know Hopefully find a village because I've been looking for a village since we started this thing and no village has been spotted But also I'd like to point out It is snowing on top of my space shuttle not on top of the world just on top of me It's not just like raining over there. It's not raining over there. It's just raining on top of me I feel like uh, there's a vendetta There we go. Now. That's what I'm talking about finally a little bit of peace and quiet Village incoming! Village incoming! That's all I got to say. We are almost there. We have found it. Thank baby Jesus. Oh, dude! There's a place to park! There's a place to park! We can park this thing right in this shit! No! Shoot! Ah! Okay, we're alright. We're alright. I'm alright. I'm alright. Don't even worry about it. I ain't even mad. I ain't even mad. Okay, perfect. We're gonna park this thing. We're gonna go down there. Hopefully, we're gonna find some supplies and, uh, you know. All right, now hopefully I can get my hands on some food in this village. Now, guys, you know I'm sorry I had to do it, but at the start of Minecraft, you gotta do, you got to feed your, you got to feed your inner demons, aka your food. Dude, I wish I, I wish this was the same series me and Redbeard were doing. I totally just steal this village and call it a spaceship. That like, guys, uh, yeah, that's what you do. This thing is amazing. I don't know what this is, but I kind of want to take it. All right, it would appear that we're going to hide out in the blacksmith shop because, well, we've been cornered and I'm pretty sure the mobs aren't going to let us out of here. It looks like we will be spending the night in this place. I don't know what that is, what's going on, but we're going to be spending the night in the blacksmith shop for further notice. In a world where you're trapped inside of a blacksmith shop, the mobs will try to kill him. But will he survive? Will he survive the night? Head out in the blacksmith shop. Stay tuned for the next episode of Blacksmith Gone Wild. All right. Well, there we go, guys. Okay, we're going to get out of here. Uh, and I have no idea what's going to happen. We're going to actually, we're not going to save these villagers. I don't even know you guys. We're just going to go. We're going to get in. Uh, we're going to get on our little boat and we're going to get out. Actually, we can probably go back to the space station at this point. But, um,. Yeah, actually I actually need that weed over there. No man, no man. We kind of need to get some dirt, dude. We're going to need some dirt. We're going to need some other things. If we don't get dirt and other things, we're not going to be able to plant this stuff. You know that? Oh, crap, dude. I just remember my bags are full. Oh! Sorry, I got scared. 
Okay, so let's just get out. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, we're good. All right. Uh, uh, initiate and warp drive. Warp drive. We're warping out. Okay, we need to park this somewhere. Let me see where we're at, and we will park this somewhere. All right, we're inbound. We're, uh, this is, uh, this is red unit one. Dude, I've gotten so good at flying this. Like, for some reason, when I play with red beard, I can't fly this thing, dude. But I'm telling you, in single player, woo, buddy, I am so good at flying this thing. This is pro. Dude, like, look how good I am at flying this thing, dude. We should have got, a, like, a... Dude, I know what we should have got. We should have, like, found a spaceship uh, map that was made, dude. And we could have, like... I don't know. Oh, God. Uh, I hope this thing can float. I, actually, it can float. So that's good. That's good. So good. All right. Now we go to the spaceship. We're going to unload some of this stuff. Uh, and hopefully, we'll uh, we'll be good. There we go. Uh, we're back. Where? So I don't think I have a chest here. I think the only chest that we have is actually on the spaceship. So we might have to use this chest for storage. Okay, so what I want to do now, guys, uh, I'm thinking about maybe jumping in this thing, moving it out a little bit, and up. Ah! Oh, no, 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 no! Oh! I don't want to hear a word. I don't want to hear a word. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, so what I got to do now is we're going to uh, we're going to click that. We're going to put that down. We're going to move forward just a little bit. Okay, let's see. Uh, I just want to be able to see the station. Uh, for some reason, it's like launching me to the ground. I believe. Like I don't. Yeah, it's like an instant drop. We got to set up the hover. So this thing in front of us, guys, sets up a hover mechanism that will let us uh, decide where we want to, like, uh, hover at. What, what like, height. So that's what we need to set up. So I'm going to bring it down a little bit. Switch over. Okay, boom. I'm going to turn it off. Okay, perfect. Now this hover thing right here will determine. Hover height target. So what, what height do we want to target at? And I'm pretty sure it's 217. All right, and then these other numbers are poop. Okay, so 217. Now, what I think that means is whenever I, uh, let's say I sit down and then hit this button, it's going to automatically try to put me at uh, height level 217. Let's see. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, it worked, it worked, it worked. It just uh, it just took a minute to get there. So let's, uh, let's hold position. Um, all right, let's see. Dude, this is good practice for when me and Redbeard play, all right? All right, so what we're going to do now uh, is while we're parked here, what I want to do is we want to kind of design how we want this spaceship to look and stuff, all right? So all I have right now is cobblestone. I'll replace this with iron and metal blocks as we go. So right now, the ship is not big enough to, like, do anything. What we need to do is we need to extend it just a little bit so we can make a storage bay because we got the cockpit currently. It's not, like, super, like, good looking, but we have it. Now what we've got to do is I made this area a little bit. Wait, is this thing off or on? All right, we're off now. So we're just going to extend this back a little bit. Well, we're already here. What we need to do is we're going to have to widen it. I don't know if I should widen. Yeah, I definitely think we should widen it. Now that I'm thinking about it, we're going to widen it a little bit. Like on the edges right here, it's going to look good. Hopefully this thing isn't like connected and uh, we're not like just floating around. All right. And from this, we should be able to, from what I'm thinking about, is we'll be able to widen this. And well, like I said, guys, we're going to make it look pimp. And I'm going to slowly put on like tech mods. I think this thing can absolutely carry tech mods. All right, so that's what we're going to do, guys. Like I said, I'm bringing zero gravity back. It's going to look amazing when it's done. Anyway, I'm just going to go, guys. I hope you guys are excited about zero gravity. What I am asking for is if you are excited about it, hit the like button. Leave a comment with what you would like to see on this season of zero gravity. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate all your support. You guys are fantastic, and uh, you guys take it easy.